in a cup of love Feel it rising up and above You will always keep my heart and soul strong Plant your seeds and watch them grow The light will always know where to go You will always keep my heart and soul strong Having lived in rented homes for the past few years, I have picked up some organizational hacks along with some tricks that also help me in decor. My day's long list of things to do is now set and my hands are itching to get started. Come along with me on what I call a hacky day. Hard-hitting doors can get challenging as they not only make a harsh sound but over time damage the walls too. You don't want that to happen in a rented home for sure. I found these tiny transparent sort of sound dampening pads that saved the day for me. Can you even see that it is there? But there's more to them. I also use them to elevate flat objects to give them a stand-like effect. My chopping board turned into a beautiful tray with these tiny legs that keep the wood slightly lifted from the surface. Did I mention already that these have an anti-skid effect so the marble platter that you saw earlier doesn't move around while I'm using it to roll chapatis. I was old, I was young. A common decor mistake that often occurs in households is sticking furniture pieces right against the wall. Furniture when kept ever so slightly away from the wall looks even more elegant. In a way an awful card you can win the losing hand. But the rain Sofas which we sit on easily slides to hit the wall, leading to discoloration and damage in the long run. My favorite hack for this is to use old toilet or kitchen roll spine. I was cold, I was bold, I had fragmented my soul. Into pieces contradicting themselves. Perhaps it is as it is. How the world is the mess means that every heart and soul needs to be whole. And the road signs keep changing as the road stretches out ahead. The afternoon sun that turned everything golden was only adding to my enthusiasm and I couldn't stop myself from continuing the hacky day. <laughs> 
I had ordered this basket quite recently, but it so happened that it turned out to be slightly big. Baskets make for beautiful plant covers, and trust me, you can almost use any basket for this. If size is an issue, then simply drop in another small pot or basket inside to give that perfect height, and you're good to go. that it is best to line drawers for ease of cleaning and long term maintenance but it's a struggle to keep them in place or keep them from sliding around especially when you're using the drawer for heavier utensils blue tacks work brilliantly for this simply cut them to size roll into balls and then press hard against the surface Believe it or not, but any home can be turned around to our advantage with simple ideas here and there. Even a perfectly designed kitchen needs to be tweaked to ensure there is better use of space. Using this tension rod over here does exactly that. Lazy Susans are my all-time favorite and this time I'm using them over the fridge right at the back where I usually cannot reach. All my nuts have a home now and this turntable makes them super accessible too. I've previously spoken about using felt pads for furniture legs to avoid scratch marks on the floor. This time I am using the bigger versions of the same thing as sound dampening pads for this organizer of mine. Evening has set in. Over here in Europe, we like to keep only warm lights on. A single lamp or two are considered more than enough to get through the night. My living room lamp that we use every single day had its switch at quite a hard to reach spot. Fortunately, I came to know about this smart plug that connects the lamp using Wi-Fi to my phone. And now I can easily use my phone to turn the lamp on or off without any hassle. Oh wait, there's more to this. I can actually set a time at which I need this lamp to turn on. And now it turns on by itself every single evening. <laughs> Isn't this amazing?
Coming back to my old but tested hack for home decor. Now that the lamp was all set, I decided to showcase some plants underneath. The beautiful snake plant sat on top of another jar for some height. Why am I doing this you ask? Only to cover it with an old placemat. Here is a solution for those who want a basket like effect but don't want to buy one. Luckily, I was able to successfully execute that long list of things to do that I had planned for the day. And now, yummy dinner was waiting to be served. So I had an eventful day. Hope you equally enjoyed the day and had some fun takeaways for your home too. Here's Home Gapshap signing off. See ya later folks.